All right, today I'm going to do something I haven't done in maybe forever, and I'm going to do a flash shot of you. Let's get into this. It's my pleasure. Okay, this is the Rovivon G4 A8 LED flashlight. Now, this thing is pretty cool. I've had this thing for nearly two months now, and I've been checking it out. So, what I'm going to show you is, it's got a really good button here. It's got four different settings. It's got a magnetic clip. We're going to go through all this stuff in a little more detail. So, I show this to you. Check that out. Uh, it's got a little area here for a lanyard. If you want to carry it like that so you don't lose it. All right. So you got the, the, the on button is really easy to use. Check this out. Okay, you got the quick flash. Whoop. Then you got the double click. That gives you the super high beam. Oh, then you got the single click. And you can kind of cycle through your different modes there. Then you got you hold it to turn it off. Then you got a triple click. Let me see how to do this up blinding you. And so you got a little sideways light. Then, and then this has got different modes. You can click it again just quickly. It goes super bright. Oh. And then you got the UV light. Let's go through that. Let's go to that triple click again. Let's watch this. All right, so there you go. There's that. And you got the blinky one. Yeah, that's for seizures. All right. So I'm going to go into the darkest place of the house and show you how this thing really illuminates things. It's pretty cool. Okay, so this is my stairway. There's Elvis. And let's see what it looks like with the flashlight. So that's a dark stairway. This little thing just lights the whole thing up. Check that out. All right. Let's see what the little lamp thing will do. The sideways won't do. So now you got a little kind of little lantern. You got to walk your way. Also, let me show you this. So you got this little magnet here. The magnet on the clip, you can't really see that. But it holds on to the door here. In case you gotta do something in the dark and you got like if you're under a car hood or something, I imagine that would work pretty good. Or I wonder if like if you're on the road and you could you need extra people to see you, you could magnetize that to the back of your truck or something. It's pretty cool. Alright, so I'm gonna see how far this thing will shine out i'm up here out of my office window and we see on the highest beam yet all right so there it is the neighbor's house and then there you can see it shining i would say that's one two, three so you're looking about 75 yards away there. I got some trees way in the back there. But yeah. This thing stays pretty bright. So about... There. There. Eliminates those trees. They're about 75 yards away. Alright. Pretty cool. The neighbor's house just lit up. All right, so let's see if we can find something to do with this UV light. Oh, how about Black Light Elvis? Mm -hmm. Black Light Elvis. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so there you go. This is the Rovi Von G4 A8, and I like it. This is a really cool flashlight. I'm totally into flashlights, but I love the magnet. I love all the settings. 
I love how strong it is for such a little tiny flashlight. It charges USB-C right there. Check that out. So you got USB-C charging. You got a really like a quick flash if you need it. And overall, I, I love this, this flashlight. So there you go. Check it out. Check it out. And this is probably going to go in my little my little thing that I take out with my first aid stuff and stuff like that that I take to uh, different places. Armrest and my little bag I take with me. Alright, so let me know what you think. You, you've seen their stuff before. This is the first time I've seen any of their stuff. So, but I wanted to give it enough time to actually do a review on it and you know, just check it out out of the box. But for two months I've been using this thing around the house. We've lost power a couple times and mostly just had it in my little baggie. But that's my mostly professional opinion. And I'll talk to you later. You're in the complete dark and you're trying to figure out what that noise is.